welcome back to Empire State Wrestling. This is The Closed Fist. I'm Russ, and this is Kate Carney. Hello. Hello. <laughs> now, uh, as we were talking uh, a little bit off camera, you moved from the West Coast. Yeah, I did. To the East Coast. I did. I was actually born in Buffalo. Yeah, um, and my mother fled in like 1994 because um, she was a vegetarian and it just didn't work here. Portland was much better for her. <laughs> um, I can attest to that. But yeah, go ahead. yeah, but you know, after a good bit of time there, I did wrestling and um, this is where my extended family lives. I wanted to try something new, try wrestling in a new place. Go somewhere where a studio apartment wasn't $1,500 a month. <laughs> yeah, that's a little <laughs> that's a little much. Steep. Yeah, a little much. So much. So tell us about your influences growing up. Who, who was the wrestler that kind of grabbed you into this? And I actually did not watch professional wrestling growing up. I dun 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 dun, dun. <laughs> until college. My entire exposure to pro wrestling was Andre the Giant from The Princess Bride did something like that, right? Yes, he did. Yes, he did. Yeah. And that's all I knew until I was like 19 years old. Um, but I. Uh, made a best friend on my college cheer team who was obsessed with professional wrestling and I started watching it and um, in a couple months I, they represented it really well on yes. the first season of glow I think yes. where there's just that like oh, this is a soap opera moment and I just was <laughs> engrossed yeah. just like that so my first favorite is not from when I was a kid but it was Eve Torres and I thought Ooh. she was just the best what brought what made her like hook you. I really liked her outfit for like the first thing just right away I was like this her when when she entered and what she wore and then she would be like surprisingly athletic mm -hmm. um, in ways that you didn't expect from a lot of the women that were presented to us in that era. Um, yeah, 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 yeah. Very good. Now <laughs> what make you know we in, in, in the uh, pro wrestling game sure. Uh, it's always about, you know, everybody sees what's on TV, the mm -hmm. cameras, the lights, a little camera here, a little mm -hmm. microphone here. What makes this work? Um, it's really satisfying yeah. when it goes really well. <laughs> it's sort of like um, being, I think, any kind of artist where you're sort of always chasing like the highest moment again. So you can have 15 matches that are like pretty mediocre and you start to get like, oh, mm -hmm. I don't know. And it was a really long drive and then I, I didn't do that well. But man, that one time yeah. that the match was like per, and you just think about that and you try to get it again and then to outdo it. And like every, every once in a while, there's just this little like, <laughs> that was so in tune, by yeah. the way. Too. Oh, thank you. It's the only in tune singing I've ever done. <laughs> um, and you just you just keep trying to you know chase the dragon. Chase the dragon was <laughs> welcome to Buffalo. Thank you. We're excited. Oh, I'm to sorry. Be here. Welcome back to Buffalo, and uh, and best of luck to you. Thank you. Thank you.